So which way are they coming from? Because I don't want to set my minds in the wrong direction and get my ass kicked. Which will most likely happen. I like how I didn't bury this guy. The guy's not worthy. Which direction are they coming? Did he tell me? I would imagine they'd be coming that way. Because what's this way? Novak. So they'd have to go around Novak. They'd have to burn Novak down. I'm guessing it would be this direction. Here goes my dick bows. For most, for the most operational mount, make sure your mines are set at an appropriate distance so they do not explode each other. Oh god. Oh god. My dick bag. Coming to the party early? That's a faux pas if you ask me. As I was saying, make sure your mines are in an operational area and so they don't explode on each other. Also, for better clearance, make sure that your mines are in a, in a concentrated area, such as um, a valley, such as this. We're going to go to head and walk on over here. Also, you can place mines under the bodies of fallen soldiers of the enemy. The enemy will pick up these soldiers, possibly, and will be treated to a surprise of death. And I think that about does it. Be sure to use appropriate mines for the enemy you will be facing. Setting pulse mines would not do much, as we are not fighting robots. Alright, boys, let's go. They're gonna come from the complete opposite direction. Either that or, like, all the NCR guys are just gonna run out there and get their faces blown off. Okele dokele. I'll be saving my game, cause I'm a man of my word. Man of my word, I only got 25 AP bullets. I'm gonna go get some AP bullets, we'll be right back. Okay, so I actually went and picked up some of the other courier weapons. There's been an update for the courier weapons mod. I reviewed it when there were like four weapons out. I'm using right now Johnson's M1941 rifle, and it's got some sweet DPS of 221. So we're going to be blowing some Legion to the other side of the world. So I guess we'll head on up and talk to Captain Joe Bob about the, uh, the cheetah infestation we're going to have to blow out of here. You ready for the, onsl the onslaught of death? Beaumont, Beaumont. I'm still going to call you Beaumont. Yes. Yes, stop. No, don't reload that gun right in my face and point it at my dick. If we're really going against company of Legionnaires, we'll need more reinforcements. I made all my preparations. You seem to have a lot of hatred for the Legion. How the Legion managed to pull off the raid here? What's your background? Uh, That's... No. No way. I'm a ranger, damn it. We can hold this post. We will hold this post. Besides... Nobody would get here in time. I've got my magical train. You would surprise the attackers with a flanking attack. They would be routed and you'd be a hero. That might work, but I don't know if they get here in time. I'll call up command and see what they can send our way. Don't hold your breath. Well, oh, oh, we're going now? Or are you just... Watch out. He will hug you. Yes. Okay. Made all my pro You seem to have a lot of hatred. Don't you worry about it affecting your decisions? No. I'll tell you what it does. It gives me reason to wake up in the morning when I'm out here, hundreds of miles away from my wife and kids. I hear assholes saying hate is always a bad thing. You almost have to hate to kill a man, at least the first time. To win wars, you have to kill. Believe me, my mind is sharp, and my judgment is sound. But when I put a 44 round through some centurion's dome, I'm smiling. Hate makes you strong. Doesn't kill you, makes you beaver. Made all, how did the Legion manage to pull off the right here? What, you aren't going to blame me right off the bat? No. I'm so used to the brass crawling up my ass about it, it's made me cagey about the affair. The Legion thrives on speed and surprise. It's a necessity, since they wear ancient jock straps as armor and fight with sharp sticks. The brass mandates dumbass search and destroy missions in the bush. So I was out on patrol. Charlie was a half strength when the Legion hit it. Sometimes the patrols are successful, particularly if we catch a Legion in a night ambush. 
These dumbasses don't use night vision, you know. But generally, the Legion outmaneuvers us in the field. Their raiding parties are hard to track, much less catch. Command didn't give a shit. I told them we were undermanned. But they just sit back in their comfortable chairs in their air-conditioned offices and yell, Drive on! Generals want kills to pad their stats. Body counts make for nice headlines and help you get promoted. Gotta climb that ladder. Xbox. But something I learned long ago is that a commander's first responsibility is to take care of his troops. That was my charge. And I failed. Hush your baby face. I can't bring him back. But I guarantee you I'm going to send some legionnaires straight to hell before I hang it up. What's your background? What's behind you? Grew up on a farm near Daglo. Joined up in 59. Spent some time with the grunts before I made ranger. Then I hunted raiders for a spell. Ooh. I marched into Bullhead with Kimball back in 70. And then did my last tour picking up the pieces at Zulu. Got here a few months back. You were an old bitch. Zulu, what happened there? Not much until my tour was winding down. I missed the big rodeo back in 79 when the Legion made a real track for it. It's a sliver of rock overlooking a pass south of Bullhead. Politicians want the base because it protects the silver mines. Silver? Problem is, they underestimated how bad the Legion would want it. Caesar's southern commander, Marcellus, just about wiped Zulu off the map. Wasn't much left when I got there. We had to rebuild the defenses, replenish the garrison. And even now, I I don't know if it's secure. Before I left, Legion scouts started showing up, sniping our troops. Rumor has it Marcellus is going to attack Zulu again. If that's true, I'm sorry for the poor bastards who are going to be there. Marcellus is just... dangerous. God help him. I think the next mod some guy's making is Firebase Zulu. I know it's Firebase something, or that's one of the future ones. What makes Marcella so dangerous? Is it his super jockstraps? He's unpredictable, which separates him from most of Caesar's boys. A lot of them are just thugs who got ranked by stomping half-assed tribals. Marcellus, though, he doesn't follow a lot of the same rules as other commanders. He only cares about winning. God damn it, Charlie. Fuck with Lanius might be a giant mongoloid badass, but his tactical approach is the same as the others. Fodder, primes, veterans, rinse, repeat. Marcellus doesn't do that shit. He actually tries to keep his men alive. Grants them some flexibility. They operate in heavily armed squads. He'll feign attacks, retreat, and hit you in the flanks. I've seen it happen to a patrol. No survivors. On top of that, he does things that just... Well... Yes? I've seen some awful shit that'll haunt my dreams. Ooh. But the worst might have been at Zulu. When a group of escaped slaves approached the camp. We're slaves, hello. Men ran down to help him. Even as I told him to back off. It was a... Bunch of kids. Just as they had crowded around him, there was... An explosion. It wasn't just a mess. It was... Sulfur, and crying, body parts, and smoke right outside the base. We picked up the pieces of six kids and eight troopers. That was before his scouts even showed up. It was his way of letting us know that he still had his sights on Zulu. He won't stop until he gets it. Okay. Good timing. Scouts radioed in, said they're about to be right on top of us. Get ready. Oh, ew. Rangers, remember the brothers and sisters who died in this spot. We have bled for this ground, and we will die before the Legion takes it. God Caesar damn. will cry when he sees what we've done to his men. Like a baby. They will weep for their mothers and beg for mercy. And shit in their pants. Oh, they are God damn it. <laughs> I told you they were gonna come over here. <laughs> I was gonna be. Oh god damn it! All my minds are in the wrong place. Don't. Oh, no, no, no. 
Yeah, but... Are those... No, those are bad guys. Come on, everyone. You're bad guys. They're hitting our mines. Because they're stupids. And so the battle raged on as I reloaded in slow motion. Not today, big boy. Not getting my NCR buddies. Don't let them run. Beautiful work, everyone. Beautiful work. God damn. Every one of you. Shit, we got him from the right. Don't let him get close to you, Jerry. I'll carve you up like a... Like a summertime turkey. Don't give him any time to breathe. Keep your eyes open, people. Just the appetizer. We got a whole burger fest coming. Burger fest. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> oh, shit. The burger fest has arrived. I hope you like boys. I mean, I hope you like burgers, boys, because we got a whole cart of them. They're running like sissies. Take down their treads. Cut it out, will you? Look, I'm shooting at them. Jesus, bitch. Everyone good? Oh, we got more. More on the left flank, people. They don't let them get in. Oh, Jesus Christ. Damn it, I need some cover. Whoa! What just happened? Oh shit! Getting feisty, boys. No, no. God damn it! I told Kali to stand back. He runs right in the goddamn line of fire. Gets his dick blown off. Where are you going, Captain Crunch? Show me those armpits. There we go. Jesus! God damn it! Oh god, no! Shit! Jerry, you crazy son- oh, God damn it, Jerry! Oh no, you stupid bitch! Oh, good. Shoot him in the knees. That's their. That's where they pee. Right in the knees. Regroup, everyone, because we're getting attacked again. <laughs> Oh my god! Jesus! God damn! I'm gonna level up like a boss. Like a boss. That's what I call a battle. 
But there was still more. These two-bit junky assholes were still coming out of the woodwork. There was an explosion. My god. I leveled up. But the dead men, those men we'd left behind, we'd never get them back. <laughs> what just happened? What explo- Oh god, dogs. Hello, doggy. How are you? Ah. <laughs> the dog just got his ass kicked. <laughs> oh! How many of these ass wipes are there? Saving these bullets for you, Castor. Got your name on them and everything. It took hours to carve it in there, but I did it. Jesus Christ! Yeah! Keep it up, Steve. They don't got their goddamn boys. They got nothing. You better run, boy. You better run. My tiny quiet gun will destroy all of you. Run, you better run. Oh, there he goes. You better run. You better run. Oh my god, how many... Jesus. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna say that's a we leveled up point. <laughs> Let's put our sneak up. Finally. 37, that's where we're going. 37, 37. And that's how Firebase Charlie Zulu Blanket Dogface Cad Bags was saved. We lost a good amount of men and women, but in the end, we showed the Legion. We were in a bunch of puss over Frankenstein dick lickers. Yeah, that's right, I said it. You think I wasn't gonna say it, but then I come out here saying it. We had to bury bone bodies than I thought we'd have to bury, but it was okay because their legs had been blown off, so it wasn't that hard to bury them. It was then I realized Ball Arms was hide sucking me. Hide sucking all the way. All the way. Wake up, Cherry. Where's that big guy we killed? Did, did someone take his armor? There you are. Castor, king of the dick bags. Just make sure he doesn't become a zombie. Shoot his face off. There we go. That's that's good. Get the legs too. Jerry, if you want, feel free to pick anything up. I'm sure they don't mind. Jerry was far too busy processing the. Horrible, horrible things he'd seen in combat. It'd be many years before he could close his eyes without seeing the face of those legionaries he'd beaten from face to the dick sack, which was half the body, if you really thought about it. Even the hardest of ball arm hugs couldn't take away that pain. All right, let's go back and talk to Captain Crunch. You did a darn great job. We only lost 1,500 people and a whole bunch of buildings blew up. Did you go inside or is he upstairs? I think that went pretty well. I didn't get brutally murdered too much. No, I didn't get brutally murdered at all, so that was good. Yes. We did it. Congratulations. Yeah, we did. Though I'll be damned if they didn't throw everything at us. Did you see Caster charging in with that fist thing? <laughs> Idiot. Steve Here's the payment I promised. I doubt we could have pulled this off without your career. Oh, you. I'm blushing. I didn't do much. I just looked pretty. The Rangers made the real sacrifice. No doubt, but you bled here with us. A little. We won't soon forget it. You're a good sort. Don't let the wasteland change you, kid. I'm not a kid. I'm a man. <clears throat> if I had sweet rocket powers, this is where I would blast off into the sky. I know I don't have sweet rocket powers, Steve. I have to blast it. But, but Jesus Christ, ball arms. You is literally... 